Yo, what's up everybody? Buzzy Games Beth here today. Let's learn how to play a sound when using a proximity prompt that is placed inside of a part. So first off, let's go ahead and spawn in a part. And inside of this part, make sure to anchor it. And inside of it, let's go ahead and add a proximity prompt. Now for our proximity prompt, go ahead and feel free to change the action text. I'm gonna say hold to play sound or hold for sound. The hold duration to 0.3. The max activation distance to five and then the object text to sound player cool so let's go ahead and add a sound object and inside of the sound properties go ahead and paste the sound id that you would like to use there that's what i am going to use perfect and then let's go ahead and add a script inside of our proximity prompt okay we have a variable which references our sound object and then a triggered function where if a player triggers the proximity prompt, then the sound is going to play. Okay, let's go ahead and test it out. Touch, oh, hold E for the sound and it works. <laughs> Pretty cool. Full scripts and models will be posted on our website. Link in the description down below. If you guys enjoyed this content, please give us a like and a subscribe. As always, have fun creating, and I'll catch you guys in the next video.